Hello to all plant lovers out there! This is my 7th vlog after a long break from the holiday season. This vlog is a bit different from the other vlogs I did because number 1, I'm on a different location. I'm currently here on a mini farm lot outside the city. So let me show you where I am right now. Okay, and number 2, this vlog is the part 1 of a series of vlogs wherein the goal is to transform this lot into a mini farm with different fruit bearing and vegetable plants. With that said, I will be uploading many videos to show you the progress and how we're gonna transform this lot into a mini farm. So hopefully you'll watch out for that. I will still upload how-to gardening tips videos later on on top of the update videos regarding the mini farm transformation project. Now, a little background on this lot. This lot is currently a sayote farm. As you can see, there are bamboo poles with wires where the sayote vines will climb. People here usually plant sayote because of cool weather. I'll be interviewing a sayote farmer soon on how to plant it so I can upload a video dedicated on how to grow a sayote. Going back to the transformation of this lot, so when you purchase a new lot, the first thing you want to do is to put a fence on your lot. To be able to do that, you must first know the boundaries to make sure that you are not planting outside your lot and to avoid conflict with your neighbors. To be able to do that, you need your lot to be surveyed by a land surveyor. A land survey, in simple terms, is a process of measuring the dimensions of an area on the surface of the earth. It is used to establish maps and boundaries for ownership and locations. Land surveyors usually use this tool to measure the distances from point A to point B. He will be going to the other end of the lot while holding the prism which will serve as an endpoint. After they finish surveying your lot, they will put a concrete cylinder as a mark of your lot boundaries. Again, this is the lot that we will be transforming into a mini farm soon. That's it for this vlog. If you have any suggestions on how to make this lot better, please feel free to comment below. Please join me as I transform this lot into a mini farm with variety of plant. And don't forget to click the subscribe button and the notification bell so you'll be notified on the next videos. Thank you for watching!